28th is the 2005 Breeders' Crown Mare's Pace, and they're off and pacing. Burning Point is under some urging there. Art Patrician on the inside. Carolina Sunshine is sprinting. In vitro is leaving from out wide and gunning on at the leaders. Uh, in between Mares goes glowing report into the top five. LD's Val, sixth on the outside. Hanover Chance is seventh. Loyal Opposition, eighth on the outside. Please Me Please is ninth. Odds on Charmaine is tenth. And Apple Chris was eleventh and last away. There goes In Vitro against Carolina Sunshine. Burning Point relegated to third. Twenty-six and one-fifth. In Vitro came away with the lead. In into the back stretch. Uh, back in second is Carolina Sunshine. Burning Point is third. Art Patrician from fourth. Setting sail to the outside goes Glowing Report and Burn is up and moving on in vitro. Up on the top end. Uh, LD's Val now moves out on cover. Hanover Chance seventh on the inside. Loyal Opposition is eighth on the outside. Then Please Me Please. Odds on Charmaine and Apple Crisp. Burning Point to the top over in vitro. First over out there is Glowing Report in 54 and 1. Locked on the inside fourth. Carolina Sunshine on to the final Final turn they go in the Breeders' Crown Final. LD's Val lurking second over. Loyal Opposition third over in sixth. Art Patrician is seventh. Eighth on the outside. Odds on Charmaine to the top of the stretch. Then Please Me Please. Hanover Chance and Apple Crisp. Burning points on the inside. Trying to get rid of Glowing Report. LD's Val coming second over. In vitro back in the pocket. Loyal Opposition is rolling wide. What a finish coming up to the Breeders' Crown. 122 and 3. 28 and 2 in the third quarter quarter. Burning Point has been passed in the center of the track by LD's Val. Here comes Loyal Opposition out in the four path. Still alive between Mares is glowing report. Burning Point is battling back but it's Loyal Opposition. Uh, Loyal Opposition and George Brennan sweep up to win the 2005 Breeders' Crown to glowing report. Burning Point and LD's Val. Loyal Opposition in 151. Loyal Opposition is back into the Mohawk Winter Circle, capturing the Breeders' Crown. Cole Muffler, five-year-old bay bear from Sing Sing, owned by Daniel Waxman of Ancaster, Ontario, trained by Irvin Miller, driven to victory by George Brennan, the 8th and 14 this year. 151 at Mohawk to capture the Breeders' Crown of 2005 for Loyal Opposition. Congratulated in the Winter Circle by Catherine Sauter, director of the Hamiltonian Society, owner of the Walnut Hall Stock Farm, and Mr. Theodore Ted Gewertz, director of the Hamiltonian Society, owner of House That Ruth Built, that won the 2004 Triple Crown, winner Winsong's Legacy, thanks to Ted Gewertz and Catherine Sauter, for the Breeders' Crown Mare's Pace, Winter Circle presentation at Mohawk. With uh, the kind of effort it would take to win tonight, based on the fact that she hit some bumps in the road this year. Yeah, she has hit a uh, couple bumps, but uh, you know she really won a good race last week. Yeah. First up, you know, good back half, and uh, you know she only got to beat less than two lengths. Uh, I was pretty confident if the trip worked out and things went her way. You know, I, you know, thought she could win this race. In hindsight, maybe it was a blessing in disguise that she did get a little bit of time off to freshen up for a race like this. Then. Uh, yeah, maybe, but uh, you know she's tough, so she just wasn't right at those times, and uh, I would have liked to have had her good at those times, and then again tonight, because she likes the race. Lots of pop coming off cover. Congratulations on the win. Good luck with Holborn Hanover in the uh, open pace and Elegant Man in the open trot, too. Okay, thanks very much. George Brennan, he's got a busy dance card. We'll let him get back to it. Loyal opposition for owner Dan Waxman, trainer Irv Miller, and driver George Brennan crown the queen for a day in the open mare pace.